don't want no fresh fried potatoes, red ripe tomatoes. I ain't never satisfied. I want the frim fram sauce. Hi, Robert's Most Yum Cooking Show is on the air. Today we have, from beautiful Blowing Rock, North Carolina, Story Street Grill. We have executive chef Chuck Nelson and sous chef Andrew Long. Tell us, sir, what you'll be fixing today. Um, today, Andrew will be preparing a crab and brie gratin, and I'll be doing a uh, shrimp and grits with tasso gravy. And then uh, for dessert, we're going to do a chocolate mousse. Well, we are raising the roof here on Robert's show. Here we go. All right. Andrew's going to start working on this All right. dish. All right. All right. We got some fire on this skillet. Yeah, we're going to get this fire cranking. All right. On high, nice hot pan. Yes. We're going to use a little uh, olive oil. Yes. Right here. Using the extra virgin olive oil? Nah, we don't use that to uh, saute vegetables with. I gotcha. That's, that's the good stuff. <laughs> I want to save it. Uh-huh. And uh, if I could get you to dice up some celery oh, be happy for to. us real quick. Yes, sir. I'm going to work on that. What I have here is a half cup of diced uh, onions and a half cup of diced bell peppers just kind of mixed together. We've got a couple cloves of garlic minced in there. So we're going to saute this along with our celery here and start our gratin. All right. Uh, tell us what a gratin okay. is, uh, please. A gratin or a gratin or gratin A is any dish with a... Uh, that's kind of topped with cheese or bread breadcrumbs or a butter mixture and broiled in a broiler or a salamander until just crispy, bubbly, Yummy. golden brown on Sounds top. Sounds so good. That's right. Yes. All right, can you grab this one? Oh, please do. This is one of those nice uh, heat resistant ones? Yes, I got that All from right, the Country great. Gourmet. My wife bought that for me, Susan. I'm so happy that she did that. And the Country Gourmet, I mean, whatever you need, you can get there. It's okay. in Fosco. You ready for these, sir? Yeah, absolutely. All right. Right in there. All right. Got this prep taxi at the Country Gourmet. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we're going to get these going. So they're just a uh, little translucent. Yes? Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, where's the Story Street Grill located in Blowing Rock? We're at uh, 1167 Main Street, uh, right on the corner of Main Street and Story Street. We got this going down good enough. OK. Uh, what we have here is I have a teaspoon of Old Bay seasoning. Yes. Now, you could use any kind of seasoning blend you want, like a Creole spice or yes. maybe a uh, you know, kind of paprika blend, seafood blend. Mm -hmm. Got a teaspoon of Worcestershire sauce. Okay. Put that right, going in, right there. in there. All righty. And a teaspoon of fresh thyme leaves. Oh, yeah. Just come, came right out of my yard. Fabulous. Tell us a little bit about your products. Uh, we have products. some Story Street products. Yes that we brought in today. We have a, a wines we bottle. We have a Chardonnay, a Merlot, a Cabernet Sauvignon, and also a Bloody Mary mix that we just started doing that's uh, it's really popular. Very cool. It's You're going to want to go to Story Street Grill and get these items that's, as well. And our website also, storystreetgrill.com. Yes. I'm going to add about three quarters of a cup of white wine here. All right. Just that's a little the bit. Chardonnay. Just the Chardonnay. Yes. It's white wine. Mm -hmm. it's one With the, the, uh, the oak pan. barrel flavor. Mm -hmm. uh, I've I've visited your website, and the menu is on your uh, website there, and mm -hmm. it's a very cool way to look at it. Yeah, a little more. All right, a little more. just want this a uh, little wet. Yes. Mmm, boy. Okay. I love cooking with wine. <laughs> now, you're going to keep stirring. Yes. We're going to have, have here eight ounces of cream cheese. Oh, wow. Cubed up. Yeah, got, notice they've already got them cubed up ahead of time. Ready to That's go. That's a term called mise en place, everything in its place. And a place for everything. And I'm adding uh, eight ounces of brie right now. And I'm going to leave the rind on because that's just extra flavor. Oh, interesting. Right now. Uh-huh. Very nice. Mm -hmm. This is beginning to melt well. Mm-hmm. Oh, boy. Brie. Uh, tell us the name of this dish again, sir. This is a crab and brie gratin. Yeah. How exciting. I'm going to go ahead and add uh, sour cream now, too. Oh, man. That's, uh, yeah, about, this is about six ounces of sour cream. Oh, boy, does that look good. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is all folding together well. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right, now, now so just so we can have uh, four different kinds of milk fat in there, we're going <laughs> to add some heavy cream. Oh, wow. This, uh, this reminds me of a French dish. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it, is, it is. Yes. Mm-hmm. I have some uh, slices you. of ciabatta bread here. 
Ciabatta. Ciabatta. Yes, Ciabatta. Nice yes. Italian uh, mm -hmm. bread. I mean, any any kind of bread is gonna work well. Almost for uh, crostini baguettes were good. Even like a day old bread, mm -hmm. something like that. Yes. And what we're gonna do is I'm just gonna drizzle these with a little bit of the olive oil. Yes. And a little salt and pepper. Mm. I'm sure people watching, are, <laughs> they're gonna wanna go there. Look at this. Isn't that fabulous? <laughs> this dish is coming together. Oh, wow. Fresh ground pepper, yes. I always try to mm, use it. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna give this to Chef Chuck over here and he's gonna toast this in the oven for us. Yes, get him toasted. This, 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 this is really, this looking this pretty is really nice, coming huh? together well, yes. Nice blend. Season with a little salt and pepper. All right, using that uh, this is coarse our, kosher so salt. This is our coarse sea salt. Yeah. Sea salt, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yes. Brought the nice stuff for you today, Robert. Oh, cool beans. <laughs> <laughs> Shall I say, great salt. <laughs> awesome. And this is our crab meat here. This is uh, oh, yeah. one pound of back fin. Yes. You just want to be, crab meat is very delicate. And you want to just be a little careful with it. I hear you. Just kind of fold this right in there. Okay. Because you don't want to break it up, as yeah. you were saying earlier. The, yeah. the less amount of stirring, the less chance of breaking it mm -hmm. up. Because it's really nice to uh, bite into those large lumps of uh, Yes, meat. I hear you. What brought you to Story Street Grill? Oh goodness, <laughs> um, uh, <laughs> uh, after I was, I've been, I was in Charleston, South Carolina for about a year and a half working at a, a wine shop there and putting together wine dinners and stuff. And Awesome. Um, my wife and I had always wanted to move up here and look in this area and we had looked around in like the Asheville area before and yes. places like that. and. It's uh, when you find an opportunity to move up here, I think everyone should take it. And that's what, we, what I did. And um, this job at Story Street just came about and it's been great. I've had a great, uh, let's see, it's been almost a nine months now. Yes. I've been here since oh. around Thanksgiving. Cool. And uh, Chuck and I have had a really great time and hope to be there for a while. All right. Oh, yeah, the man. Yeah, the scooper. prep taxi. Uh, yes, that's a fabulous knife for doing that you know job. I'm going to add about did. half of these in here. Okay. We add uh, our green onions at the end because uh -oh. uh, they tend to get a little uh, stringy or mushy if you cook them too long. Mm -hmm. and they retain their flavor a lot nicer. All right, I believe this dish. This is ready. Is done. Yeah. Yeah. This is ready. All we're going to do now is uh, scoop it up. All right. I want to thank ECLA Lodge. Um, Chef Chuck has used the salamander here um, to toast the... Christinis. Yes. Uh, oh, man, that's so good. Mm, mm, mm. What was that pretty? And we're going to just top this with a little bit of extra brie that I brought. All right. That is so cool. Mm -hmm. That knife works so well, Chef. It does, Chef. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> and we're going to broil this under the salamander for a few minutes. Oh, yeah. It's going to get nice and bubbly. So although we have a salamander here at Isiola, you can use your mm -hmm. broiler in your oven to mm -hmm. do this. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. This is it. This is our crab and brie gratin. Um, uh, this is just a great dish for having little parties, get-togethers, people snacking on it yeah. uh, when they come over. and. Uh, that's it. It's a, just a creamy blend of uh, peppers, onions, uh, some nice big crab meat, and brie cheese. That's it. Woohoo! Story Street Grill. Got about full service catering. You do it all, don't you? We can do anything. If we want to go simple, we can start with our fabulous hickory smoked barbecue that we cook ourselves eight to ten hours. Or we can go to something elegant as uh, grilled lobster tails, filet Ooh. mignon. Ooh. We uh, have our own linens, china. Uh, we can provide tables that everything you need. We try to find out what you know someone's looking for, and we tailor a menu to that. So it's a it's a custom arranged experience. Yes, sir. Uh, have food, we'll try. <laughs> Hello, I'm Pat Parks. And I'm Dave Parks. Welcome to Distinctive Cabinetry and Design. We're located at Shops at Twin Rivers in Fosco. Whether it is a kitchen, bath, home office, library, or entertainment area, 
we at Distinctive Cabinetry and Design understand that we are creating more than just rooms. We will work with you to develop a design that fits your specific needs and tastes. So stop by and visit us and our staff at the most beautiful and complete cabinetry showroom in the high country. The Country Gourmet of Fosco is the place to find wonderful gifts and finest cookware. Dishes, silverware, candles, clocks, and many surprises. Even those hard-to-find items that you can't get anywhere else. Gifts for him, gifts for her, gifts for anyone who enjoys special things. For more than 30 years, the Country Gourmet has been a must-see stop in the high country, so don't miss it. Visit the Country Gourmet weekdays 10 to 5 and Sundays noon to 5. The Country Gourmet of Fosco, where kitchens meet creativity. Come to the historic Skyline Village Inn, a comfortable lodge with rustic accommodations, spectacular views, and a unique history. Use our beautiful new conference room for meetings, banquets, special events, and parties. The Skyline Wine and Beer Shop has the area's best selection of beer and wine. The Skyline Cavern Tavern is a complete restaurant featuring great food, thick juicy steaks, seafood, vegetarian fare, and mixed drinks. We're located close to home at milepost 331 on the Blue Ridge Parkway in the junctions of 226 and 226A. Welcome back to Robert's Most Yum Cooking Show. Executive Chef Chuck Nelson from the Story Street Grill will now prepare what dish, sir? Um, I'm going to do a...